हरि ओम नो द ट्रूथ एंड ट्रूथ शेल मेक यू फ्री टूडे इज वी आर सेलिब्रेटिंग इंडिपेंडेंस डे द फ्रीडम और इंडिपेंडेंस इज मल्टी डायमेंशनल देर इज पोलिटिकल देर इज सोशल देर इज एकनॉमिक एंड बियॉन्ड दैट देर इज समथिंग कॉल्ड स्पिरिचुअल फ्रीडम इफ यू गो बैक टू हिस्ट्री फॉर द पास्ट थ्री हंड्रेड ईयर्स we have been under the influence of a kind of an oppression and many many sacrificed their lives dedicated their lives came together fought for more than a century starting from jhansi lakshmi bhai all the way up to mahatma gandhi ji so finally we have gotten our political freedom or independence this independence should be preserved and nourished every generation needs to understand this we have democracy and this democracy is probably the best form of organization in this modern life and democracy works with only citizen consciousness so all citizens must be aware and participate in this democratic system so that we preserve this independence now how do we achieve this all citizens should feel that they belong to a collective which we call it a nation and we all have to respect and do our part in as many dimensions as possible so we have to be socially responsible and we are socially accountable and we should do or perform all the duties of a a good citizen then only we can have a good system somehow our educational system by foreign um influence we still continue to uh, go through the same education system that is uh, pretty much makes um workers what we need not only the ability to do or or skills development but also uh, consciousness um, awareness and uh, samskaras we call it in our um, traditional sanatana dharma samskaras meaning uh, a process by which we go and become and rise up to our fullest potential so our education system must be uh, restored that makes conscious citizens ethical citizens people with character people with strength a country full of uh, people with strength it makes a strong country and the other aspect would be prosperity krishito nasti durbiksham meaning we all have to work to create prosperity and that prosperity has to be sustainable equitable and also fair so we must work there should be a strong work ethic to go along with our educational system so all these aspects uh, samskaras uh, work ethic um, the courage the strength and um, a consciousness that we all belong to a nation then only we can have a healthy society prosperous society and beyond that if when we develop our spiritual awareness then we can transcend into a higher dimension and create a perfect and harmonious society where anybody can rise up to their fullest potential it has been almost 2000 years um 
during the course of uh, human evolution and development. We here in modern age, we have um, brilliant technologies and lots of comforts. Um, we have achieved that. I think what we are lacking is um, the personal values, uh, ethics, uh, consciousness, uh, citizenship, uh, and also spiritual uh, evolution to be able to see as uh, we are all one, we are all one nation and we have to do our part in creating a free society, independent society, prosperous society, a conscious society. So this is the work that needs to be done. And then we can become more progressive or developed and we can continue to uh, experience or enjoy these privileges of so many sacrifices that so many people have made to create this and which is a gift we have to not only protect but also preserve and pass it on to the next generation and it is the responsibility of every citizen. It is called good citizenship. Sarve Bhavantu Sukhinaha Om Shanti Shanti Shanti